North Park is a neighborhood that has been transformed by the arts. In recent years, this uptown San Diego community has become one of the hottest neighborhoods in the region, drawing locals and visitors alike to experience North Park's galleries, music venues, restaurants, and events. Forbes even called North Park one of the country's best neighborhood for hipsters. Named for their proximity to Balboa Park, the neighborhoods of North Park and South Park are connected by 30th Street. And if you love food, shopping, or craft beer, then 30th Street just might be your idea of heaven. Join me for a day in North Park and South Park to discover the creative and crafty spirit of these neighborhoods. Beginning at the north end of 30th Street, along El Cajon Boulevard, there are plenty of unique spots worth visiting. Start your morning with a perfectly poured cup of coffee from the Coffee and Tea Collective, before checking out the Media Arts Center San Diego Digital Gym. This urban cinema space offers film festivals and screenings by local movie makers and big name directors alike. Let's talk with the Media Arts Center's founder, Ethan Ventillo, to find out more. So this is a very cool space we're in. Based on the name, you know, it's called the Digital Gym. <laughs> mm -hmm, <yeah. laughs> Doesn't look too much like a gym to me. Uh, how would you describe the Digital Gym? It's a community technology center and uh, independent movie theater. Um, and it's a space where we want all ages to come in and learn new skills that they need for their home or for their school or for their work. Uh, and we play on words. We want people to flex their 21st century technology muscles, come in, take workshops, do one-on-one -on -one personal training. This is a really nice, intimate theater. What kind mm -hmm. of movies do you guys show here? So in addition to the uh, classes that we have for kids and adults, we also have independent and foreign films that we screen here every day. And so we want people to come out, have some good food, and then see great independent films or foreign film, and or have uh, their kids or uh, themselves come and learn new skills at our community technology classes. As you head south along 30th Street, you'll cross University Avenue. This is the heart of the North Park neighborhood. Here you'll find the historic North Park Theater. The theater was renovated in 2003 and today hosts musical performances by local and national bands. And with numerous restaurants within walking distance, it's easy to do dinner and a show in North Park. As you wander along 30th Street and University Avenue, you'll find tons of unique neighborhood shops offering locally made goods. For the ultimate North Park arts experience, be sure to visit on the second Saturday of the month for Ray at Night. This monthly art walk showcases the wild and creative spirit that makes North Park a haven for artists and young innovators. From North Park, the South Park neighborhood is just a quick walk or bike ride down 30th Street. Take some time to stop in for a craft beer at Modern Times, where the decor is just as artfully crafted as the beer. In South Park, the intersection of 30th Street and Juniper is where you'll find some of San Diego's most unique and creative shops. You never know what treasures you'll find at Make Good, a local shop stocked full of creations by local artists and crafters. Let's head inside to talk with shop owner Sophia Hall to find out more. Make Good is a store that sells 100% locally sourced goods. And what I mean by that is all of our artists that supply the goods in the store live nearby. So they're all literally in San Diego County and then a few across the border. So kind of our region, um, handmade, local, and recycled. That's what we're about. You can find um, just about anything. We are very diverse because we have over 130 artists. So there's a lot, <laughs> a lot going on in here. I don't think a store like this would survive if art was not important to this community, and it is. And I think you see that in the food, the bars, the coffee places, the shops. There's an artistic spin to everything done here. So it's like a magnet for artistic types and creatives. Our final stop along 30th Street is at Beach Street, where the culinary arts really shine. On this quaint corner, you'll find Alchemy, which offers a farm-to-table menu and creative cocktails, and Hamilton's Tavern, which is always packed with craft beer lovers. Across the street, Bona Forchetta's authentic Italian dishes and Neapolitan pizzas keep visitors lined up for tables on their sparkling patio. There's no limit to the creative energy you'll find on 30th Street. 
For more ideas on how to spend the day in North Park and South Park, visit sandiego.org, and I'll see you soon in San Diego.